Hey, it's Molly. Happy Labor Day and happy back to school. I'm excited about my next um, Lunch and Learn series. It's going to be do's and don'ts of a real estate transaction. I'm going to focus on some simple things that we can do up front to give a better, cleaner experience for our customers. Uh, one example that we'll cover in class will be the way that you, um, as a realtor, list the name on the purchase agreement is how the deed will be drafted. Well, everything we have to do has to match the deed. Therefore, if um, someone's using their nickname, uh, for example, Jim Larson, and they write their purchase agreement that way, however, they really want to go on the deed as James A. Larson, um, it prevents having to do future amendments, um, chasing those down, time, money, effort, etc. So I'm just going to pack it full of small tips like that to be more efficient, more fiscal, um, so that we can have a really cohesive and wonderful transaction for our clients. Hope you can make it and have a wonderful day.